This is where it gets dodgy. I'm being scammed. So I tried to sell my MacBook Pro on the trusted website Gumtree and let's just say there are a lot of scammers on there. In this video I expose all the people that scam me and trolled about with them. As I said in the intro, I'm trying to sell my laptop, it's not very good. So I decided to list it on Gumtree, why not? That's a good platform to put it. So here's some of the responses I've got and the scams that are on Gumtree, let's have a look. The first thing you notice, know look at all these inquiries about the laptop. Uh, there's a lot here, let's just pick some random ones. So he starts with, hi, how are you? I'm interested in buying your item as a gift for my son. Please reply as soon as possible. I said yes, it's available. Would you like to view it? Because on Gumtree how it works is, it's a collection only thing really, but technically you can go down the route of doing the PayPal method. This guy, Anita, Anita, right? Isn't he the old left back for played for Leeds United? All right, let's just carry on. Uh, I like to, oh God, he's an awful player. You can't forget about him. Um, I would like to buy. I would like to buy the item as I'm not around town, and I would. Oh, that's convenient. Not around town. It would be a town you live in as well. Flexing now, are you? I would want you to post the item to him on my behalf. The way it's written, you don't write. Okay, go on. How much is the total cost of the item plus the shipping cost of seventy-five pound? Well, can you not count maths? If it's on there for five hundred and fifty, you just add seventy-five. Come on, man. Six six hundred and twenty five pounds. You need to do your math for mathematics. I can send payment via PayPal. Dodgy. Kindly text me your PayPal email for the payment. So how how I, I see it is I've been scammed numerous times when I was younger, yeah, and I've learned from that. It's a good thing to get scammed in a way, because you learn from it. So if you ever in this situation anyone selling anything and they ask you for your PayPal, so you give them your PayPal email, whatever your PayPal email is, and you do not ship or post and send off uh, by delivery, the item, unless you see in your account that the funds have been put in. Not by an email, because what they do, they send you these dodgy, and I mean dodgy geezer uh, emails. They'll send it to your junk email, essentially, so that's already dodgy. They're like, oh yeah, just check your junk email, because it might be in there. Like, why would it be in there? It's clearly junk, that's the whole purpose of it. So I said, what's, what's the shipping address, please? He said, I will send you the details once I make the payment, which is a bit weird, then why would you not, we need to know where he lived, okay, but what's your PayPal email for the payment? Gave him my PayPal email. Have you made payments yet so I can post, that's what I said. And then, and then good old Anita said, hold on, I just got off work now, I'll make payment and let you know. Got a busy man. I said, sure. He said, I can make permit first thing tomorrow morning. Oh, how convenient. I thought you just got off work, mate. I need get, oh, I need what? That's not even English. I need get on Deji, wow, really man? You're, you're promoting on my video. <laughs> this guy says, I need get on a chopper now. If that, work, if that won't work, sorry for wasting your time. Give it to the next bar. This is the weirdest scam I've ever seen because they're just saying, yeah, if you don't want to be scammed, then see you later, jog on. And he, he said, I need get on a, which doesn't make sense. And then he said chopper, which in my mind instantly says, Helicopter. What? Who is this man? Is this like Bill Gates or something just flying on his like 4.2 million helicopter? I just said, yeah, sure that works. I just say, okay, I'm going with the flow. He could be minted. That's why he's buying this. He said, great, thanks. Just to let you know that I made the payment and I got a and I got email from PayPal saying that the funds are out of my account. This is where it gets dodgy. I'm being scammed and the funds are out of my account. Be sure to check your email for payment notifications, okay? So what they do is they send you a fake email to your junk and you open it thinking, oh, the money's coming, but it hasn't actually come in, it's fake. So we post the item and then they just get it for free and probably delete their account and like, I've just made a few bucks here, Jesus, forget this YouTube thing, let's scam people. Oh, and I said, no funds in my PayPal account, when they are, I will post it. He said, I want to inform you, this is what, Oh, Anita, man, you need to stop. Just stop. I want to inform you that I have made the transfer to your account and it and it has been deducted from my PayPal account. Oh, that's convenient. How do we know that? Like, there's no proof, like physical proof. And even if they were to show proof, it'd probably be fake anyway. Be sure to check your inbox, junk or spam folder for the notification email alert from PayPal. It's not from PayPal. They'll put the watermark at the bottom. They'll put all the details there. It's just, it's just lies, man. I said, no problem. I was being nice to him, dude. We didn't want to be too harsh with him because I thought I'd be nice to him. I played him right in my hands before I get nice and comfortable, and then BAM! When the moment strikes. That was a bit extreme. We're not, we're not, we have no violence here. I said, no problem. Once clear funds are in my account, I will happily post items. Smiley face, because emojis are cool, aren't they? The old Anita. He's a friend of ours now. Let's just call him friend, yeah? So, Anita, my, my best mate, basically, said, 
Great, thanks for letting me know. You have to post the item out first and send the tracking number to PayPal for verification so they can clear the funds into my account. That is not true. They all say this, that we have to give them a tracking number first. So I think what what to do is either just say, no, that's, that's a lie, that's just a scam, or give them a fake tracking number, maybe for something else, and then see if they do post it. But don't actually post it though. It has already been deducted from my account. You just said this three times. I think you made it pretty clear. But even though it's a lie, I'm pending in yours. Well, I've looked at my account, nothing there. This is just to ensure the safe transaction of both parties. Safe. Safe, yeah? Okay. So I got bought this one. I just straight said to him, no, biggest scan I've ever seen. LOL. Haven't you got something better to do in your life right now? It's so obvious. So I said pay first and then I'll send. Because otherwise you can just send the item and not pay. And I said, but seeing as you do have all this free time, you should subscribe, man. And I put the link there. And I sh** you not, last night I did gain an extra two subscribers. So hopefully Anita's joined. He's joined the gang. We're going strong. Hit that subscribe button. Join the army. Join the squad gang. Do you know what? That's what I'm saying. With me, I don't call my fans anything. They choose what they call our community. We're just the, we're the NZ family. Let's just call it that. Hopefully you're watching now, Anita. What's up, man? How you doing? I ain't being scammed this time. Here's another one. Someone said, hello, I'm interested in buying your MacBook Pro. Is it still available? How much is your last offer? And I can see if I'm okay with the price. What do you mean, see if you're okay? I'm not selling it. Uh, kindly, kindly to hear back from you soon. Again, what's with the broken English? I just don't understand. Use Grammarly, that's a really good website for spell check and essays. That, that's not a brand or I don't even know why I said that. I keep seeing the fucking ads pop up on my YouTube page. I said, yes, yeah, still available. Would you like to view it? 530 is the best price. That's, he said, that's good to hear. I'm still in a good, is still in a good condition. I don't know what that means. And furthermore, we're getting pulled out the big boy words here. Jesus, this guy must be like 14. Um, if you're interested in, if you're interested in accepting PayPal for payment, that's the best way and secure, I'm sure it is, for me to send you money. I hope this is convenient for you. No, I think the safest way is you to physically come to my door and just give the paper so I can just have it straight away rather than doing it. I said, condition is perfect. I then proceeded to say, also, yes, PayPal is okay, but if it's a scam, please do not waste my time. I've had too many of these messages today. Collect or pay legit on PayPal, I will not accept spam emails. I will only post your item once I see the money in your PayPal account. He said, okay, no problem, that's cool with me. Oh, he, what a cool dude he is, doesn't he? Sounds it. I'm not here for that. I'm gonna fund your account. Uh, don't be panic, okay? <laughs> don't be panic. Oh, I'm just gonna be the state of panic, am I? And he's telling me to don't panic. I'm, at this point, not panicking at all. He should be the one panicking. I will get back to you. I will get back to you when I'm back from work. Why are all these people at work, man? They all have like jobs conveniently at the same time. I said, sure. <laughs> he said, okay, that's cool. Stop saying cool. Like it's, it's not cool to say the word cool, please. Let's conclude. Like, it's, what is this about the PayPal payment? I hope you have PayPal. So share me. Share me your infos. <laughs> not even not bother to be infos for the payment. He said hello. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> Again, what's with this? Well, what's your number so I can I can call to notify me for the payment? This is so this has just happened. I just think I gave him my number. Now he said where are you located? Well, what do you need to know where I'm located for if I'm posting it? So then I asked like I told him where I live and I said can you collect because it'll be much easier if he just collects it. And bearing in mind, I forgot to mention at the start, this person is from Derek. What the fuck? If you name your child Derek, do not speak to me. A young Derek, yeah, I thought you're gonna get a Thanos fist to the face. So this one's from Tunner. These names, you can just tell instantly from the names, like, it's like Tunner. What does that mean? It's like Tuna or something. He's, he or she, not, I'm definitely not assuming gender with this name, of course. And it's 2019, like, are you good? Still up for sale and what's your best offer? I said 530 is the best price. Good, I'm interested in it. Full stop. I'm willing this oh my god. I'm willing to send you £650 for it, which includes express shipping to me in the uh, Kingston upon Thames. So Kingston's about half an hour away. He can literally walk to my house, but he's saying the shipping ship it. How can you ship from here to Kingston? What along the River Thames? Jesus. It's like it's half an hour away in the car the, uh, where Kingston is from me. And he's telling him to ship it, and it's gonna cost another hundred and 
100 pound. What is this? Payment will be sent up front via PayPal. We'll be glad if my offer is accepted. Okay, I said yes, that's okay. Give my pay gave him my PayPal, of course. Get back to me with your full name and how soon you'll be able to mail out the postage. Like, that's all they care about. All they care about is being posted to them. That's not, they're not worried about them paying. It's like, yeah, I'll, I'll just won't pay. Like, they just, just don't. They just they just don't get how money works and just buying something you have to pay for it to receive it you have to give to receive well uh, not in not in certain contexts but you have to generally speaking you have to give to receive that's great thank you once you got the payment notification from paypal no this is this is bullshit, man this is uh, such age like this is not fair oh so then our good friend olabami olabami okay let's just go over is the mac book two different words Still available to sell. It is, yes. Would you like to view it? Cool. Again, with cool. I think they all just work in the same community and they all think they're cool. Cool. The price is stated is okay to me. Due to my work, I would love I would love to pay via PayPal. And would also the postage fee of £30. Is that okay by you? Like, where on earth are they getting these prices from? They're just throwing out prices. I'm the one who chooses the prices, bitch. Gave him my PayPal details once again. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be, like, scammed somehow. Like, even just give it. I've given my PayPal about 100 times. Okay, I will message you via this email address. Kindly reply ASAP. So, so, so I as to conf confirm if it is really you. Thanks. No, this is a bot. This is a bot, isn't it? I just message you. Kindly reply ASAP so I can proceed with a payment. You know, you're not gonna pay, man. Just shut up. Go play Minecraft or something, man. Nah, Loki, that game was sick back in the day. Martha said. These names, still available. I said, yes, are you interested? Yes, the price stated is okay. They all start with the same thing. The price stated is okay for me. Further down, okay, we just pulled back and forward about paying it. He's not gonna pay. And he said, oh, I am sorry getting back to you late. Well, well, I will be sending you a message via your paper email. No, you will not. You did not send that, Martha. So, and so good old Andrew here, he said this, like, I remember, I'm not going to go for all of it, I basically said, sorry, I know this is a scam, and I put IK, yeah, because people know, people should know the slang, you know, IK, I know, I know this is a scam, and then, uh, I'll just talk about it being a scam, he said, sorry, where did you see 1K, I don't understand you, eh? You don't understand me. Oh, that's convenient, isn't it? It's not like I understand anything you've just said in that sentence. You took it way out of context. I said IK, not 1K. How can it be 1K? It's on there for 550. Oh, needless to say, people on Gumtree are scams. I'm never ever gonna use this website again unless I'm personally buying something. Do not try this at home, seriously. All those scammers out there, I know you're watching a video. I know you're sitting at home with your flaming hot Doritos on your like couch just waiting for your next plot move but just don't just stop i don't know what this video is anymore thank you for watching this video if you did enjoy this video be sure to leave that thumbs up button because it really does help the channel subscribe down below join the army join the family of inzingi trust me you do not want to miss out hit the notification bell as well you never miss when i upload which is really good and also i'm uploading every single day can we get a round of applause i've uploaded every single day this month let's have a round of applause for that yeah I don't think anyone cares really. But yeah, this year, every single day I'm uploading daily content, creative, all of that. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next one in a bit.